Hey, what's up everyone? This is Josh, back to make yet another video blog. And uh, basically today, gotta tell you about my last Friday. <laughs> and here's <Hello>. Zane. <laughs> this is... Sherman Zane Stone. Yeah, he's like my best friend. So, his only friend. Shut up. Last Friday, me and Sherman went with Kirsten and Kelsey to Six Flags. Not so much for Six Flags, which was also pretty cool. <laughs> but mainly to go see Family Force 5. Sorry it's backwards on my shirt. <laughs> but this... Get your mirrors out. To be an epic t-shirt can only match the epic band. Very glittery. So, first off, let's talk about Six Flags. Six Flags was pretty good. Pretty fun. Kind of hot. Not too crowded. Yeah, not too crowded. Let's. How long do you think we waited in most lines? Um, ten minutes. Ten minutes, maybe forty for the Titan. Maybe. Maybe thirty. That'd be the longest but wait for sure. It was fun, yeah, and we ate lots of, not lots. We ate some good food. It was very expensive, and uh, twelve ninety nine for souvenir cup. Ten ninety nine with my uh, bank ticket, and uh, free refills all day for the first day, which was worth it. We drank lots of stuff. And Zane really isn't this short, actually. He's actually, I'm like a foot taller than Josh. Not really, but he's about as tall as me. But due to our chair situation in this room... We had an awesome rocking chair. He <laughs> has a bar stool. <laughs> we had to deal with it. So, you know, we rode most things to Six Flags. Kirsten didn't ride very many things. What did Kirsten Party ride? Cooper. She rode, rode, ride. Teacups. <laughs> we didn't ride teacups. Carousel. Oh, she rode the carousel. That uh, creepy girl on the carousel. <laughs> she was pretty funny okay she wrote uh, the log ride did I say that already yes uh, what she wrote the Yosemite Sam ride <laughs> Tony Hawk and Tony Hawk which okay. was surprising Very so surprising she gets on Tony Hawk <laughs> and I was like Kristen it's not scary nothing oh she wrote Judge or Scream she hated that oh yeah and so very rough Tony, Tony Hawk so like we're going <laughs> going and we go over the first drop and she's like <laughs> and but uh she liked it so that was good we tried to get her to ride the texas giant but she wouldn't she would have hated that i could barely handle it it was a little rough <laughs> anyway we rode pretty much everything we wanted to i wanted to ride the flashback we didn't ride it but it's whatever then oh, so really? we got some churros kelsey got a pretzel very delicious Got some churro on side of my neck somehow. <laughs> still he got not, stabbed. Still not really. Churro. Still not really sure how that got there. <laughs> but uh, so then, like, we were gonna go to the concert at seven. It's the One Voice weekend. Uh, so that night was KJ Five Two, a Christian rapper, Pillar, a Christian I don't know metal band, Hawk Nelson, a Christian punk pop band, and then Family Force Five was a Woo! headliner. Family Force 5, I don't know. I don't Amazing. know how to describe them, like, what genre to classify them. Because um, they're kind of like everything. Crunk. crunk rock, really, is what crunk they usually... Crunk religious rock gospel. With some, like, synth... I don't know. It's, like, yes. the coolest mix of music ever. So, we get there. KJ52 is in the middle of his set. I thought he was going to be really cheesy. I kind of liked him. He had some cool 80s tributes. But we didn't really pay that much attention, because that's when we got, like, our merch. So... We did that, and then, who was next? Um, Hold on, mom. <laughs> My mom's calling me. <laughs> Pillar, Pillar, Pillar was next. Pillar preached a lot. Pillar talked so much. It was exhausting how much they talked. Hold on, mom, we're making a video. So, they were whatever. They were talented, just not really me, my thing. Hawk Nelson came on. You know, I, I like some Hot Nelson stuff. They opened with that one song of theirs, Bring Em Out. I like that one. And then they played a couple songs, and then they talked for seriously, like, probably ten minutes without stopping. And it was really obnoxious. Like, I'm not gonna lie. But I guess they're talented. So, I sang along to Letters to the President, and what else? California. California. And that's it. And then, here's the cool part. They leave. We're like sitting really far away. So, 
I see these seats at the front, right by the ramp. And I'm like, okay, let's go up there. So we go up, and we ask these girls. And first of all, this girl was wearing the exact same shirt I was wearing. I have my other <coughs> people put your hands down shirt on, and she's wearing it. So it was other awesome. people put your hands down. Oh, gotcha. Oh, <laughs> trick. So anyway, uh, these girls were sitting there. They're like, no, no one sat here the whole time. So there's four seats. It's perfect. Right at the edge of the walkway. So we sit down. And then, lo and behold, a security guard walks up. Oh, no. <laughs> and he asks if we have tickets. And we don't for that seat. So we had to leave. But I decide. Thanks to me. Thanks to me, actually. I convinced Josh to go back and use his persuasive skills. I go up to the security guard and say, Sir, I'm not trying to be a pain in the butt, but, you know, no one sat in these seats for the whole concert. We've been watching the whole time. And, you know, we'd be willing to pay a little bit extra or whatever. We just really think these are good seats and no one's out here. Like, we've been watching the whole time. And he was like, you know, I'm not supposed to, you know, these are special seats. And I was like, well, I mean, no one sat there at all. We've we even asked these girls. And so he said, well, I'm not going to say yes or no, but if yes. anyone comes with these seat tickets, you have to move. And so I was like, well, that's understandable, but thank you so much. So I motioned to my friends, and they were like, Oh, hey. What? How'd you? Oh. It was awesome. So, like, we're in the best seats, and then Family Force 5 comes on, and oh, I can't even describe this concert. Can you describe this concert? No. It's undescribable. Immaculate. Epic. <laughs> Endless. Infinite. Oh, my goodness. I feel like I will never again see a concert at such a caliber. It was amazing. Like, you know, like, I think if I were to put on a concert, I wouldn't be able to, <laughs> I wouldn't be able to hold that energy the whole time. Like, they were just so high energy. It was awesome. And like, we were so close. Like, we touched, who did we touch? Solo, Solo Activator, Crouton, Fatty, and Xanadu, who is a kind of a part of the band, but he's like their dancer. So, that's his only job, is to dance around the stage. That's the yeah. job I want. He plays the tambourine. <laughs> the <dancer. laughs> that's the job I want, too. Tambourine dancer. So, I screamed. I screamed to every song. I danced. Jumped. I freaked out. We, like, ran and, like, gave him high fives, took pictures. I'll post those later. My neck is still sore. Oh, my goodness. We, like, we were drenched in sweat when it was over. And, like, I couldn't talk. I was going to tell those girls, because they said something about Twitter. I was like... Hey, y'all should find me on Twitter. And like, literally, that's what my voice sounded like. Luckily, my mom, being the smart lady she is, packed us a whole ice chest of water bottles. So on the way home, we pretty much devoured those. Water's best drink at lukewarm temperature, though. It is. Just a safety warning out it there. It truly is. It's the best for your vocal cords. Yes. I'm, I'm a singer. That's what I do. Yeah, I mean... I know these things. We are actually in our own band called... Um, it's called The Stone 2. Two Stoned. Yeah, Two Stoned. <laughs> <laughs> no implications of uh, weed use there, really. It's his last There's name. There's just two people. It's not last yeah. name. Yeah. And, I mean, I'm cool enough for my name not to be in it, so you should actually uh, look us up. We'll start posting some music soon. Yes. The Stone 2. That two. is Two Stoned. Two, two Stoned. Stoned. So yeah, look up Two Stoned. Uh, if you haven't listened to Family Force 5, check them out. They're awesome. And uh, y'all have a great night. Family Force 5 is playing October 22nd at House of Blues. I'm hoping I can go see them again. Maybe if I get tickets right when they go on sale, I'll have awesome seats again. Maybe I can convince someone to let me go backstage. Maybe Zane will go with me again. Maybe this, maybe Take two... Maybe Two Stoned will be the opening act. Yes. Yes. Definitely. Look for us at House of Blues October 22nd with Family Force 5. What? What? Woo! Woo!